In this video, we're going to create a billing invoice. We'll click on the Billing tab, and you'll see a list of previously created billing items. Of course, you can always go back and watch our Create a Basic Billing video. We'll go ahead and create a new billing invoice. First thing we'll do is input our submitted date. You can generate today's date by clicking here, or you can choose any other date you need. We can add a comment. And we'll need to select the billing items for our invoice. We're going with last week's billing, so we'll uncheck this date. Then we'll save changes. And our invoice was successfully created and submitted to our office manager for approval. We can always desubmit if we need to make any changes to the invoice or billing items. We can delete the invoice if we need to. After we've submitted the invoice, we can download a PDF or Excel file with or without details. Let's take a look at these. Clicking on Personal Billing takes us back to our main billing page. We can view a billing summary report that will display all approved invoices. You'll see that our recently created invoice has been approved. We can also generate packaged billing information. This will include all invoices, billing items, and expenses for up to a full year span. And you have the option to include all file or image attachments. You can email a download link to the selected user. And we'll generate the package, which we can download as a zip file. And that's an overview of how to create a billing invoice in the Totaland system.